Um, I think uh, having Peter is a, is a blessing for us as a team and um, it's like for, for every player, you know, every player is important in, uh, in our squad and uh, we we're very lucky to have him back and uh, it just increases the options that we have up front and um, you know him, you know, like uh, when every game that uh, he plays in and he tried to, try to make sure that uh, he gets a goal and uh, that's, uh, that's what we want. Like uh, the coach was saying earlier that uh, when we're in Tanzania, what you complain about was we really, were not ruthless enough up front. And uh, I think uh, having one extra option up front will, uh, will increase our chances of being more ruthless up front. Who has covered the question last uh, when, when the coach spoke about you know, the demands that he wants from you and the players, you know, if you had in, in agreement to what he said, can you just list some of those demands that he wants? And secondly, uh, your improvement as a player ever since working under Coach Black. Thank you. You know, I won't finish today about <laughs> the demands. Uh, it's, uh, it's a lot, you know. Um, but uh, the most important part is uh, being better than we were the previous day, you know. Um, every game that we play, like uh, going to, to, to the game now, uh, we need to play better than we played uh, the previous game. So he always tried to push us to, to our limits and um, we appreciate that as players, he makes us better. And uh, what was your second question again? Uh, the, the improvements that you've had. Oh, there's, there's, there's quite a lot, you know. Um, uh, I've learned a lot, you know, um, like the game has, uh, has evolved so much that um, it's, it's no more about positions anymore. So uh, there's a uh, there's a lot to mention, to to be quite frank. And yeah. Uh, Rusa, um, just how complex and uh, challenging or entertaining, or whatever you, what you want to use to play this uh, chameleon football the coach is talking about. You don't know if you are left back, centre back, defensive midfielder, sweeper. You know what I mean? So. Is it fun? Is it challenging? Is it annoying? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, so annoying. <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, in the beginning, we didn't understand it. Yeah, but uh, the more he explained it to us, the more we, we trained it and we actually started to get it. And it's, it's confusing for the position, but it's really nice for us because we play pictures, we play what we see, what we see around us. So we understand it, the whole team understand it. Um, so I would say it's it's exciting to play it. Yeah. yeah tell them you call me crazy and behind my back. So. <laughs> no, but I tell them your face. <laughs> <laughs> I think uh, for us the most important part is to win the game. You know, we we work very hard at training. We try to make sure that uh, every game that we play, we we respect it and uh, we make sure that our supporters are happy. So we we don't really how do I put this? Um, yeah, like uh, like I said, we we just. We just play every game. We just take it one game at a time. Try to make sure that uh, we get the maximum points. If it's a league game and if it's a cup game, we make sure that we go to the next round. Um, and we, yeah, that's all, man. That's that's all we do. Mr. Gatteko from the Citizen. The coach mentioned the Zatulele Pass of Obviously, you guys also talked about Peter Shalulele being there for you guys, but. 
how do you plan for a player that's on form like that? And you know, is that something that you guys think about heading into the game, or is it more focusing on the overall team of Orlando Pirates? Yeah, well, first of all, I think he's in an unbelievable form, and uh, I think it's uh, it's good for the country. But uh, we we focus more on the team. You know? um, we try, we'll try to make sure that maybe we cut the supply to him, and uh, make sure that uh, we don't give him a chance. But uh, we focus mainly more on the team as a whole, not individuals. You really step back in as a player coming up against a player that's on form like this uh, as a defender. Yeah, it's nice, you know, I mean, having to be tested against a person that's really high in form, you know, it makes you, like, be on a very high concentration level and and you have to be on your toes all the time. But um, I think uh, the whole team has to be on toes. I mean, it's a big game, yeah, the game of that magnitude. Uh, everyone wants to play that game and um, hopefully we win. Just, just a, a slight follow up to that question about the focus. I mean, we all know that Coach Rulani was the man behind giving the likes of the Kevin Basa, the Kevin Stavignanis, the Pirates, and he has got so much info on those players. They are highs, they are lows, they are positive, negatives into the game. How much do you guys rely on, especially as defenders, when you get a guy like Ibasa, that the coach, you know, expects you to actually go out and do what he tells you based on what he knows. How important is that aspect of the game, having to get relevant information from the men who actually help them to progress where they are? Yeah, it's, it's very important. I mean, he he spoke earlier about um, about uh, watching little details of every player. So that's that's what we do when we do videos. Like, he, he underlines even some some of the things that we we don't pick up so i think it helps us a lot when when we go into the game and we we get to know more about the player because luckily he worked with him and uh, he he was telling us more a little bit more about him and we kind of have a picture of what we're up against and that will help us a lot <laughs> They, all of them, they are amazing players, and I think uh, the most important thing is, um, as a player, you have to know who you're playing with. You know, um, I think uh, all of them that you mentioned, I know their strengths and their weaknesses. So I know if I play with this one, I have to keep high line. If I play with this one, I have to play in a certain way. So um, yeah, these very good players. Um, I think uh, very lucky to have uh, such such players, and it's exciting to play with them. very difficult but um, luckily we have a good coach who's always behind us, always backing us, you know, always um, push us and um, last season when we, we got knocked out uh, we fell down but I think um, <coughs> this season again you have to keep on trying. I think the most important part is to keep on trying again even even when you, when you feel like you don't want to do it anymore but just keep on going and who knows, maybe someday the door will be opened, the, the one we keep on knocking on. So 
I still feel our time is coming. Um, we just have to to work hard, keep persevering, and um, yeah, we'll get there. And if you had a question for the coach later on, uh, around it. Oh, mm -hmm. you still want to ask us about the quality of coach? Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Coach, um, around the stadium under the lights is a, is an important match uh, for Sunrise fans. And you can tell it's important for also uh, Pirates because um, Jose rested nine players in Botswana the other day. So it's really chosen the benches that he, it's a big thing for him. Um, coach, what are the intent, in terms of mentally, what are the intangibles? That the players might need to bring because it's a big match because like you you also want to keep your unbeaten record. They also if they lose the match, they they I think they're eleven points behind you. They they slip further behind you behind you in the league. So what are the intangibles that maybe the players need to bring to make sure that you get all the points? Um, I love the the question. I I, I honestly love the question. I feel that if the question was about another opponent, I would go into so much detail in answering it. But it's so difficult for me to answer that question with us having to play Pirates. It's very, very difficult, and for, for many reasons, you know. And one of those is the respect that I have for the football club and for the chairman and uh, of course some of the players that I worked with and uh, and the love that I get from some of the pirate supporters still uh, but also I don't want to talk too much about that because I've also got a responsibility as a Sundowns coach to show respect to this incredible football club, to show respect to uh, our unbelievable uh, supporters that come in numbers and sing and beat the drum and, and uh, support the, this magnificent group of players. So, so uh, what we will do is uh, pitch. And I think that's that's as far as I can go in answering the question. Is the the intangible is that we will pitch, we will, we will show up. Thank you, coach. Thank you, thank you so much. Thank you, guys. Drive safe, man.